In the water, they found... I got the bottle! And the flip-flop. Are you surprised by what you're finding? Yes. What have you found? A pill bottle, a um, bobble, a whole entire lure, can, cigarette butts, a piece of rubber. We met volunteers with the High Five Initiative at the Turtle Habitat at Marina Park in Port Deposit, right on the Susquehanna River. It's kind of shocking seeing how much, like, people disrespect the environment and stuff and seeing, like, that they just don't care for the natural wildlife around here. This cleanup focuses on giving northern map turtles the best habitat, and they were spotted on branches in the water. They found a home here uh, on their own long before humans were here. About 40 volunteers, including several under the age of 18, collected 2,800 pounds of trash. Even tires were in the piles. We're trying to give the turtles a straightaway. Uh, to be able to come up for the nesting season that's going to start in about a week. And look at all the branches brought up. Here's a before and after of the beach. There's a lot of trash here. So, I mean, I, I was expecting some trash, but there's definitely a, a lot of trash that I wasn't expecting. Towson University partners with the town of Port Deposit to have a research facility on site. This time of year, uh, a couple things happen. One is that the hatchlings that were uh, laid last year, they come out of the ground and they book it to the river. And the other thing that's happening this time of year is that the females are coming up to lay nests um, and those are the ones that'll hatch out next year. So it's important to do some spring cleaning. Coffee lids, water bottles, a bunch of foam. It's pretty crazy around here. You get a lot of illegal dumping as well as water uh, being released, like I said, from the dam. There's also trash with that. That kind of washes up with high tides on the shores, gets caught in the rocks. The state endangered species in Maryland may move slow, but they have a purpose. They're doing what's called cycling a lot of nutrients. So they're helping recycle things through the, through the uh, ecosystem. They make poop and things use the poop to build uh, food webs that eventually um, culminate in the things that the turtles will eat again. So it's another reason the trash needs to be picked up. It's so that like babies don't like choke on it, eat it. If you want to help out the High Five Initiative, there are several more opportunities to do so this year. They focus here in Cecil County on the Susquehanna, Elk and Northeast Rivers. Sometimes volunteers are on kayaks in hard to reach places by land. Just helping out the environment just makes me feel good. For Chesapeake Bay Media's Bay Bulletin, I'm Cheryl Costello.